Hello everyone and welcome back to Echoes of the Plum Grove. My name is Melanie B. We are now on to Tuesday, day two of spring in our very first year. Okay, so let's actually check out what quests we have to complete. It's pretty early in the morning, but let's check out our quests. So we need to know your neighbors. So we still need to meet eight more people. 10 of the 18 have already been met. And we also need to pay our taxes. We got some time on that. We don't have to pay it until Sunday. Okay, I think we are good. Let's head on outside. We got crops, but it's raining today. Yes. So we don't have to worry about watering our crops today. But we did have a quest in town. And someone needed 20 pieces of wood. So let's look at that. Was it a one day only quest? Uh oh. It might have just been for one day only. So we might have missed out on getting the reward for that. Well, that's, that's unfortunate. Let's go ahead and cut down some of this grass. a lot of grass here so there's grass and there's weeds and um, we need the site to cut the grass but the weeds is that taking some of our energy I wonder and one thing is we are kind of getting hungry now we've got some food in our inventory not really sure how much each one fills up. Let's maybe wait until we're lower in energy before we use that. Just in case it fills up like your whole hunger meter. Okay, we got a bunch of grass. Got some of the weeds as well. So I think we should probably head into town and check out the quest board again and then we'll go try meeting some more folks okay let's head into town right now now we can use the fast travel to get into town so let's go to this one right here we'll reach at 9 17 a.m I like that we get to know exactly when we will arrive. Let's give the bush a little shake. So what is this? Is this an apothecary? Maybe. This is Jessup Edward. You're Melanie B, right? I've heard about you. I'm Jessup Edward. Okay, nice to meet you. Mabel Chesney has an impressive collection of seashells at her house. Everybody seems to be really impressed with Mabel. <laughs> okay. Um, can we purchase stuff? We can inoculate. Cost 200 coins. Oh. What is this up here? Yeah, it's telling us we're hungry. Time until starving. So by 2329, we're gonna be starving. So we should eat something. Okay, let's... Um, let's get out of here first. And we'll check out our backpack. So we got pemmican. 21 days until it's rotten. Well, that's good. Plus 16 for hunger. And then we have journey cake. Three days until it's rotten and plus six. Let's go ahead and eat some of that. Um, please. How do we eat it though? We eat it from our hot bar. Yeah. Okay, so it fills up some energy, and now we're no longer showing that warning. Okay, we're gonna go look at the quest board, and this time we'll have to get it done in the one day, I guess. Oh, maybe we never accepted that quest. Maybe that's why it's not showing up. <laughs> uh, we'll take that. And there's another one. Some wanted fish. A 
I'm in the mood to prepare a meal with the requested fish below. Well, we really don't know how to fish. Uh, skilled crafters. I don't have the tools or know how to make this. Good reward if you can make me one. A chest. Um, complete in five days. Should we go for that? Because there's some good rewards here. I think we can probably craft that. Let's see how long the fish one actually lasts. Six days. Maybe we'll learn to fish by then. So we'll take that one. And... This is Gigi John's. Yeah, Melanie V. Okay, I might forget that. I was not expecting Honeywood to gain a new residence out of the blue. No worries. If you can't decide on a fishing lure, you can't go wrong with a good old-fashioned worm. Fish are smarter than they look. To catch them, you have to learn how they think. Oh. Uh, do you sell fishing lore? Let's see, we can trade. Oh, so this is what they sell. So how do we... If I put stuff here, it gives me a value for everything. Oh, okay. We can sell the straw that we got from cutting down the grass. And... We can sell stone as well. Okay. Uh, we have this drying rack. I think I'll hang on to it. But now what we have here is worth 22 coins. But we can't afford any of this stuff. I mean, the tallow almost, but we don't really need it. So let's not trade. And we can also... There's a, but, a butcher option, but... Doesn't look like we can access that just yet. Let's see if we can get to some more stores. The bakery. The bakery was closed yesterday. Oh, there's a few people here. There's Sarah Edward. Welcome to Honeywood. I'm Sarah Edwards. You're from the mainland, yes? Oh, yep, I am. Whenever I eat eggs and cheese for breakfast, it fills me with energy for the rest of the day. Okay, and we can also trade with her. She doesn't have anything, though. Okay, nice to meet you, Sarah. Let's talk to the bakers. I know we're still talking to Sarah. Uh, Bridget Floyd. You're Melanie B, right? I've heard about you. I'm Bridget Lloyd. This might surprise you, but Benjamin Whitfield is really fond of bug catching. So long. Okay. <laughs> and there's Martha. Martha and Bridget. You're Melanie B. I've heard about you. I'm Martha Lloyd. Hope you're having a lovely morning. I am. Let's see what we can trade. So we can purchase flowers and bread. Some seeds. Hay seeds. Uh, potato seeds. Ooh. Kind of want this. Let's maybe get that. Um, that's going to cost three coins. And... Um, let's do some hay. There we go. So we sold her our hay. And we got one single potato seed. I think it'll be useful. Okay, thanks a lot, Martha. Now, how many people have we met? We need three more people to go. We've already gotten to 15 of them. Oh, this is Grumpy. Let's say hello to Temperance. And does she trade anything? Nope. Okay, let's go over to the blacksmith. Is this the blacksmith that wanted the wood? Maybe we should have brought his wood. Um, there's Rose. Welcome to Honeywood. I'm Rose Swain. Nice to meet you, Rose. And this is Roland Smith. Matthew Bailey owns a cow, so I bet he drinks fresh milk every day. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> and Daniel Hopkins. You're Melanie V. That's funny. I think my name's better than yours. Okay, little kid. Oh, wow. We can trade a lot with Daniel, though. He's got a lot of money. He's got like 906 coins. We only got 30. Jealous. So, we can upgrade our tools. 
uh-huh uh, we can buy like copper bars and coal iron bar and some amethyst there's some interesting things here uh, oh he has onion seeds um yeah let's get these it's gonna cost six coins that seems to be a fair trade there we go thank you So, how many people do we have left now? Just one person left. Are we going to be able to find that person? I hope so. Let's give some more trees a shake. We need to get 20 pieces of wood still. And we have to remember, anything that has a black outline we can interact with. This is Lewis Johns. I hope your voice wasn't too rough on you. I'm Lewis Johns and I'm the butcher. Nice to meet you, Lewis. You know, I'm glad we have Jessup Edwards as our doctor. He is dependable. Okay, what kind of traits can we do? So he's got some cooking oil, beef, pork, meat, and some tallow. Okay. See you around. Was that the last person? Yeah, we met everyone. So we need to get back to the mayor. Oh, we're gonna get a bunch of seeds. Are these cherries on this tree? Can we get this? <gasps> yes, we got some cherries. Let's take that. And we'll pick those up. Okay, well, we don't need to go into this dairy. Uh, is there anything else here we can collect? Still need some more wood. Let's pick that guy. Get this tree. Are we up to 20 yet? Not quite. And there's a couple back here. Shake, shake, shake. So close. That one is not outlined. Let's pick that. And that. Okay, we got the wood we need. Now we need to figure out about fishing. Um, let's actually look at the map. So I feel like... We can fish around here, maybe. Or, or maybe we should go down to the dock. Oh, there's a fish sack. Let's take our fast travel into town. We need to go talk to the mayor. We also need to talk to the blacksmith. Hello, mayor. Howdy, Melody. I was hoping I'd run into you. Um, let's turn in our class. You have no idea how helpful you've been. Oh, I wish Mary wasn't so hard to deal with sometimes. Marriage is about give and take, you know? <laughs> okay. And we can trade with the mayor adoption papers. Papers needed to adopt an orphan or a stepchild. Oh, okay. Wow, look at how much money the mayor has. He's rich. 19000 Okay, so adoption papers cost $55. Yeah, we don't need that. Okay, see ya, Mayor. Did we actually chat with him, though? Let's chat. Roland Smith makes tools for all the farmers in Honeywood. It's an important job. Now, does it say who we chatted with throughout the day? Okay, so... Right now... It shows some information about each person. So, Quentin would feel as a mayor. Uh, we've met Benjamin. He has a daughter and a wife, but we haven't met them. And Benjamin we did meet. It says he has a mother sister. He's excitable. He's a child. <laughs> He's also a student. So it says a lot of information about each person. So it says your gender, male, female. Your traits. He's social. Okay. And where he lives. Got it. 
but it doesn't like show like if we interacted with that person for today or not but there is like a positive meter and a negative meter so if it's in the green that means we're going in the positive direction so i'm assuming if it gets into like the lower section or it turns red maybe that means we're not doing so good with that person i don't think we should fight with anyone though okay now over to the blacksmith let's turn this quest into and maybe we can make it over to the fish shack and let's turn in wood you're a lifesaver thank you you're welcome so we got some nails and i think that is an improved axe oh no we didn't even have an axe before okay well that's good now we have an axe uh, we still need to get to the shack, the fish shack, before it closes. Hopefully it doesn't close at like 2 o'clock. Otherwise, we might be out of luck. Okay. How do we get in here, though? Here we go. It's around to the side. Hmm. Might be too late. Does it have, like, hours of operation someplace? Let's see here. Fish Shack, Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays from 7 a.m. to 9, and then 1 to 3. <laughs> Very specific hours, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So we'll have to come back tomorrow. Three days a week. And we got something new there. What is that? Sand. Okay. Well, we got some nails. And I know we had one spot that we needed to fix some stuff. But I think we should probably head back and plant all these seeds we got. So let's fast travel home. I love that we can fast travel so early in the game. Grab some stuff along the way. Give these items a sh little shake here. And we'll shake this tree. Any special wood? No, just regular wood. You will take it. Okay, I wonder with my axe if I can chop these bushes down. So let's switch this here and see if we can chop bushes. No. Here we go. Can we chop this stump? Yes, we can. Too so bad we can't chop those <laughs> bushes out of the way. What about this big tree? I don't know if I should chop the trees down because I can shake a daily leaf of wood, right? But for now, I kind of just want to plant stuff. So let's plant all of the seeds we get and we'll get some pre-watering today. Ooh, we got some more wormies. So I'm assuming we can use worm as bait. So this might be good for tomorrow because we'll go see the fish shack tomorrow and see if we can get a fishing rod. Because we do have that one quest that someone needs us to catch a fish. Okay, um, what are we planting here first? Some sort of seed. Maybe I should check what seed that is. So this is potato seeds. We also have wheat. Spring, summer, fall. Uh, turnips is spring. Cabbage is spring. This is six days. Turnips are three days. Wheat is seven. And we also have some peas. 
These are eight days, but it replenishes every two days. So we definitely want to get this on the ground today. Let's put that up there. Let's put all the seeds into our hot bar for now. I've got to figure out what this drying rack does to you. Oh, we also have onions. Five days until it matures. Oh, we actually have a lot of seeds to plant. This is good. It might not be so good when we have to water it tomorrow, though. But we'll cross that bridge when we get there tomorrow. But we're gonna need some money, so we definitely need to plant all the seeds we have. Now, I wonder how much our taxes actually are. Okay, let's plant this set of seeds next. Looks like we might have to dig up some more spots. Well, it was very generous of us, of the mayor, to give us this much seeds. Okay, we got all these spots. Well, one more to go. Um, let's go up a few more spots. Well, all we can do is hope that there's a lot of rainy days. The more rainy days, the better. Okay, and some onion seeds here. We're gonna need a couple more spots now. I wonder how long it will take us to water all of these tomorrow. Okay, all the seeds gone. We got some food left over, so that is good. So right now, we're not tired or anything. We have full hearts. What does that mean? Uh, for health? Is there combat in this game? And we're not hungry yet. Okay, things are looking good for us. So let's go ahead and use up a little bit of our energy. Might as well. Because it's 7 p.m. We still have got lots of the day left. I'm just gonna pick the... The weeds up. We won't cut any grass. Now, if we have hay from siding all this grass, that means we're gonna get animals. So we'll just hang on to that. Okay, let's grab a few more weeds. And I think we might be able to sell these. That will be a source of funds for us. Okay, that's quite a bit we got there. And let's look at this quest list here. So we have skilled crafters to do. We need to grab this wooden chest. So we'll go into the house and see about that. Okay, wooden chest. Uh oh, I don't see a wooden chest. Oh, it's right here. So, oh, we need an iron bar. Well, we have enough wood. We'll need one more nail. How do we find nails? Is that something we craft as well? So we can purchase an iron bar. I wonder if there's any place we can go to find some. Let's go back outside. I wonder if we can find some from like the rocks. Let's break some rocks. 
So far we've only found stone. Maybe there are some special types of rock. It's hard to see behind the house though. Okay, what else is on our land? There is some rocks there. Yeah, we're probably only going to get stone from the regular rocks. So we'll have to figure out where we can find some other stuff. Let's look at the map. Maybe there is some sort of quarry or mines or something we can go to. Lavender Boutique. A school. Bloom's Bee Farm. Oh, we should go check that out. Button Household, Odell's Clothing Company, the Ice House, where ice is stored for the town used to help preserve food. Oh, that might be useful. The Apothecary, the Butcher, Bakery, Fish Shack. So I will check out the Fish Shack tomorrow. Checked out the fairy on uh, the farm today, the Dairy Farm. House of Spells. Oh, what's up here? A mine. There is no fast travel to get up there, so we'll have to walk up there, it looks like. We'll do that some other time. Definitely not today. Okay, looks like we're getting a bit tired now. Our eyes are looking a bit dozy. We'll pick a few of these guys. Okay, let's let's head to bed maybe. So the hearts and the status bar here is not the same as the heart out here. What is the difference? Not really sure. But I feel like we should maybe use up some more energy even though we look a little bit tired. But I also don't want to pass out. <laughs> Let's just clear out a few more weeds before we go to bed. Mm, can I get back here? Yeah, we can. Oh, we got some hay from that one. And break another rock. And with all this stuff, hopefully we can use it for trading. Okay, it's just about 11 p.m. And we should probably be heading to bed soon. But I want to... Try to get this farm as cleared out as we can. This is actually pretty huge. Can we shake these trees? We should be able to. Okay, how much weeds did we pick up? Oh, it's straw. So we got 99 pieces of straw. And the stacks are up to 99, it looks like. Okay, let's go ahead and head to bed. We got a whole bunch of crops all planted. And I'm gonna put this stack of 99. Okay, let's click on this. We'll put that in there. Just one click to put it in. Um, what else should we get in there? Oh, maybe we'll check out the trying rack tomorrow. Let's head to bed. And we shall call it a night. 
So we can sleep for until dawn, until rested. I think we should sleep until dawn. But I think that is going to be it for this second episode. Thank you very much for watching.